You go first. Oh my. Jeez. Whoa. Oh my God. I told you. That is fing crazy. We're just ordinary people on this Pacific island with no rules, no knowledge, nothing. Even though this has been really hard, it's one of the best experiences of my life, and it will forever stay up there as one of the best experiences of my life. I can't believe the experience so far. We eat, sleep, work together, spoon together. We really are like a family. There he is. There he is, Mr. Bear. Bear. Mr. Bear. Hello. 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 Look at you guys. Good to see you. As I said, this island will take you to the edge. Is that true? Yeah. 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 Oh Honestly, it's just been absolutely soul-destroying, but exhilarating at the same time. Survival is hard graft. You are fighting just to get a drink of water, but every mouthful of food is so rewarding. That sense of achievement just, like, starts to well up. I come in now after 33 days, and you're different. You realise, actually, it's relationships with the family that make your life amazing, and that's the great thing about it. Imagine if you could do this island in a tablet and you give it to someone. How many relationships would it save and how many families would it save? You've worked together, you've loved and cared and for each other. And we've done it. Yeah. There's a final task before leaving the island. Thank you for the warmth. <laughs> Thank you for the food. Thank you for the water. Thank you for being the heart. Now piss off. Now piss off. <laughs> OK, let's get you guys out of here. Look at that. It's done. We dropped them as two groups, the men, the women, and there was no guarantees they'd ever even meet up, let alone stay together. But they understood the strength in numbers, man, woman, using each other's strengths, and that's what they did, and that's why they survived. Hi. Come on, all the way along. Oh, my God. Shit. This is really, really sad. pleased that like so many of us have got here together really. I kind of don't want to leave but at the same time I'm just desperate to run away. I'd love everybody to have that realisation that we're all running around like chickens without bloody heads trying to earn a lot of money when we could be at home making pizzas with the kids and laughing and you know having a really joyous time. Guys. I'm going to spend an awful lot more time with my family realize here how much you miss them and how absolutely precious time is it has broken me and made me again i think i am a determined person i am a strong person this very moment right now i really feel like i can take on the world i feel like i have taken on the world i've taken on this island it's a pretty big deal <laughs> You're definitely whiter than me. <laughs> oh. Whoa! Whoa! Mad! I did not think I looked like that. That is literally like my real. Your waist is so small. The islanders have had no contact with home for over a month. Ah! Hello! Hi! <laughs> Hello. Hi, Mum. 
Rose, I just can't wait to pick you up. I can't wait. I can't wait to just everything. I can't wait to live the rest of my life with you. At the end of the day, they really came together, and it's a real sort of testament to all of their tenacity and their teamwork, that they're all together at the end, smiling, positive, so proud of all they've achieved. It is the best feeling eating all of this. Fantastic. Oh, my God. The pineapple is it's just insane. like... Yeah. I can't believe how much our taste buds have changed. Having been stripped of any luxuries, they're finally reintroduced to the modern world. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <sighs> Feels weird. <laughs> oh, some crisp boxes that I kept clean. There's no raindrops coming in. There's no sharing. There's no scorpions on the floor. I feel like I'm on cloud nine. Everybody should do this, and we'd all be better people. The end of it, what for me shines bright, is their courage and their kindness. And with that, you can survive an island and conquer the world. <laughs>